everyone, it's True Creeper MC here, and we are going to be playing a little bit of Discourse today. Uh, you, you guys might have heard of this game. Uh, it's a game, it's a choice making game where you're stuck on an island and you have to make choices to get off. So, um, yeah, we're gonna play this. We're gonna do the whole thing. Uh, we're probably gonna do it in two parts. So, that's probably what's gonna happen. So, play. Alright, let's do the uh, regular one. Alright, new game. Yeah, so I already played before just to test it out, you know. Um, yeah, so your paths forwards are on your own. There we, there, there we are. We are her. Oh, my brain feels like it went through a coffee grinder. It feels like I've been lying out here for hours. What is all this crap on the beach? Wait, a plane crash? But I was- oh no! Alright, stay calm, Rita. So her name's Rita, by the way. Alright, so we gotta investigate this stuff. Uh, yeesh, good thing I wasn't in that seat. Let's see what's this? I can't believe this is real. Yeah. Alright, what the heck is this frying pan doing on the plane? They're closing in on us, huh? What the heck was that? Alright, let's go check out. I should go check out that noise. Uh, let's go investigate. I don't think there's anything uh, that we have to do back here. Alright, so we got. Uh, uh, Oh my goodness. <laughs> they're going for their backup. We're totally surrounded. Make sure you aim for their eyes. It will scramble the chips in their brains. It doesn't even matter. We're done for. Uh, she's probably here to feast on us, just like the crabs. What are you talking about, me? You're totally clueless, aren't you, Daddy? And hey, lady, now might be a good time to help us. Alright, um, I am coming. Uh, I got a trust me metal detector on me, but they will definitely attack if I pull it out. Just get over here and help me. Wait, no, come come over here. Well, I might well try to put this frying pan to good use. Alright, so let's go uh, do this. Um, scared crab by swinging frying pan. There we go. Whoa, that actually scared them away. Oh, jeez, there's Teddy. Okay, there we go. Ouch, those things are fierce. My legs are all torn up. This isn't good. Okay, well, let's get back to the camp. The others will want to meet. Or, um, I didn't catch your name. It's Rita. Wait, are there other survivors? Yeah, they're they're fur farther inland. I'm Steve, by the way. And my name and my name is Teddy. I'm gonna think of a name. Uh, a voice. Um, he looks like he looks old, but he also looks young. Like so, I my my name is Teddy. Something like that. All right, let's get going. Okay, here we go. So, anything to investigate? Not really. Yeah, there's really nothing to investigate. Oh, there's metal records all over the beach. I'm kind of glad I didn't remember the class. Must have been terrible. All right, let's, uh, yes, let's go. Sure, let's get going. Don't you think it's, a oh, I'm gonna stop. Don't you think it's a little risky to take the stranger back? What if she's just a bunch of crabs in a human suit? You're only, uh, you were only an only child, weren't you, Teddy? No, my brother was a human. I think we'll be fine. Let's go, Rita. Alright, so we're going to camp. Uh, let's see what other survivors there are. Here we are. Look, and uh, oh my goodness, I gotta think of names. Um, uh, he's kind of a gaming guy. So, look, another survivor. Uh, what? Uh, he has a what? I thought we were the only ones. Heavens to Betsy, come have a seat. Heavens to Betsy, what kind of it? Uh, you must have been out for hours. Are you alright? Uh, yeah, I think, yeah, I think so. That's good, none of it, oh my goodness, uh, that's good, none of us have seemed to have been injured in the crash. What's your name? Rita. I'm Jolene. Oh, so that's Jolene, gotta remember these. That lump over there with the must. that lump over there with mustache, that's my husband, George. Hi. Online, I'm known as Nebulord90, but you can call me Garrett. All he's been doing is playing games with his stupid handheld video machine. Hey, where are we? None of us are really sure. We know we're on an island. This is probably... This island is pretty big. We have no clue what kind of stuff could be on the other side. There's a mountain off in the distance, but it's a long hike away. We have no idea what's over there. We started making the best of here situation. I got this fire belt and we got started on some shelter. So far, all we... So far, all we've got for food is a pile of pretzels from far off the plane. Oh, here comes the boars. Take away those. Jeez Louise, my sweet cream and cheese! Oh no, the pretzels are only food! Oh darn, that must be such a well-balanced meal for us. 
I feel like he, she should have like a. I feel like Steve should have uh, some kind of uh, accent. I don't know. Uh, what? There are more of those. Those pig monsters out there. Rita, Rita, you come with George and me. Let's get this boar. Or er, I don't think that's the best idea. It's not like. It's not like we have weapons to hunt them. My Georgie has his own fishing pole. He can flop them with that. And I sup and I sp oh my goodness. And I suppose you're gonna throw that bulk of camera viewers at them. Well, I'll do what I needs to be done. We need to stay here and defend the few resources that we got left. Come along, Georgie. We don't have much time for this, and I don't trust these hoodlums. Hoodlums? What are hoodlums? Uh, Rita, you ready? Let's go. All right, let's um. <sighs> so. Here's the thing, I have watched videos on this, and I've actually played this once, and I'm pretty sure there's no way we can get the food, so I think it would be a better uh, time if we stay and protect. We should stay and protect what we have left, let's not run out into the desert. Ah, fine. Is, is, is someone else up for it? Rita's probably, or Rita's probably right, we should stay here. Good grape gravy, we all gotta be kidding me, cowards. Let's go, George. Oh my god! Goodness! Oh, I should have done that. There. Did you not hear something just now? Uh, I don't think so, Teddy. You're just paranoid. I bet he gets that a lot. We could have got food in the fire here, so definitely attract some wildlife. Oh my goodness! No, Teddy, we need a plan to defend our food. We can't afford. We can't afford to lose it. Okay. Um. <sighs> got this. I got this. Stay on your toes. Here we go. Let's try to let's try to watch your back then. I don't know how much I'll use after the battle on the beach, but I'll do my best. Positions everyone, here they come! Oh my goodness, this is dumb. I'll be fighting with this frying pan. What have you guys got? Oh, well, I got the scapler, but I can uh, hardly call that a weapon. My trusty metal detector can give them a good beating. Oh, when did he bring that out? Okay, okay, here we go. Here we go. Um, stand your ground. Look out, Rita! Yeah! We got him. Ugh, ouch. What the heck was that, Garrett? Um, I, um, I thought I could help. You fought off that boy. Looks like the other ones are leaving, too. Yay, we win. I don't know if I would call that a win, Garrett. I wanted to protect you. <sighs> um, let's try to be nice. Uh, thanks for trying. Garrett, that probably wasn't the right thing to do, but I appreciate it from here. Uh, be quiet a second. I hear something. Oh, gosh. Uh, throw some. Oh, my God. Throw something at it. No, no, it's just us. Did you get the food? Probably not. Um, welcome back. Welcome back, guys. I'm glad. Wait, welcome back, guys. I'm glad you made it. Well, I, well, I'm not. We could have been killed there. Uh, you didn't even bring back the poor. Uh, if I had some help from y'all, maybe it would have gone differently. You're, you're not making great first impression, Jolene. <sighs> um, we need to get some rest. Listen, we should all try and get some rest. We can pick this up tomorrow. I think it's going to be a long night. We need to protect these pretzels. We shouldn't just leave them out in the open. That's a good idea. Maybe we should have thought of that at the start. There, that should help. Anyway, we set up a bit of shelter this early morning. Uh, Rita, why don't you grab a torch from the fire and let's get some sleep. Uh, let's grab some of this and go over and sleep. Wow, you guys actually pulled together a pretty decent shelter, all things considered. Uh, I guess this is our home now until we get rescued. This torch won't last forever, but I should have enough time to talk to a few people. Alright, uh, let's talk to Teddy first. Uh, this whole system is simply outrageous. What are you even talking about? Well, isn't it obvious? This is a test. The government wants us to see if we're qualified. Qualified? Uh, I don't even ha do I have to spell out everything for you. We're being watched. I saw some sort of government agent on the plane. I have reason to believe that he was following me. Um. Uh, really? Really? That's odd. That's. Are you serious? That's kind of suspicious. He was sitting next to Garrett, and they were talking. Um. That is pretty strange. I have to admit that is pretty strange. Uh, we'll have to keep an eye out on him, unless he's keeping an eye, eye out on us. All right. So Teddy went to sleep. Um. I don't know, Garrett. What do you think? I bet you've never I bet you've never been on an adventure like this before. Virtual reality is pretty advanced these days. Through it doesn't hold a torch these past hours. I can't exactly emulate starving or dying. And we're probably going to die out here. No extra lives to save games to help us out. 
were you on the plane? Were you on the plane? Alright, why were you on the plane, Garrett? What? I didn't really expect that question. Sorry, it's just Teddy mentioned he thought he saw you with somebody on the plane. Oh, well, I'm not really sure. You're not sure? I don't really want to talk about it right now. Oh, so maybe Garrett was involved with something because he doesn't want to talk about it. I don't know. Alright, sorry I asked. It's time for me to regenerate my hits. Oh my goodness, no one cares. Oh my goodness. I don't care. Okay. <sighs> well... I do know some. I, knew, I do know a decision that I think I'll have to make in the future. So I don't know. I'll talk. Uh, I'll talk with Steve. Uh, finding you on a beach was a surprise. We were pretty lucky you were there, I guess. Yeah, that was all. The, yeah, that was all the disorienting to wake up to. Yeah, Teddy was looking to find some supplies on the beach. All we could find that horde crabs. Ahem, and me. Yeah, but you may have been off of the group. Don't think I've a lot to the table. Um, uh, group be being alone. I'm, I'm better, I'm better off with the group than by myself. Even if we're not exactly a bunch of survivalists. Oh my goodness, I just skipped one. If I hadn't met up with you guys, I might not have even made it this far. Groups have never paid off in my experience. Oh come now, come on now. The world isn't all that bad. It isn't. It isn't all that good either. Well, let's get let's get some rest. The torch is low. It's time for me to go to sleep. Time to go to sleep. Doesn't look like very comfortable. Like I said, through the night. Might as well try. Okay. Oh <sighs> well, night one completed, guys. I think we did pretty good for our first day. Um, there's something suspicious going on with Teddy and Garrett. I feel like. See if we can ever get to the bottom of that. Oh, huh, looks like we actually made it through the first night alive. Yay. Uh, I'm ready to get something done today. Doesn't, I don't think you should be doing anything. Whoa, what do you mean? All, this, all you did yesterday was make things more difficult by leaving. Well, I'm going to help y'all if you think you'll need me. Fine, if you wouldn't see this, got a headache already without having to argue with me. Maybe you're planning someone to blame while you were asleep. Which one of you was it? Speak up. The way he talks this is just really weird. I suspect Garrett. Huh? Why me? Alright, guys, I think we just need some coffee. Caffeine withdrawal makes me feel like I'm in college again. Drinking something usually helps. No, salt water. I'm gonna, I'm gonna check the record from now. Maybe my string of bad luck will end. Who knows? There may be some water from the plane as well. We need a signal for help if we ever plan on being saved. <sighs> Alright. Um, either we could do fresh water, we could explore the crash site, site or we could make a signal. I mean, I, I, I think a signal is the best to go because you can survive a couple days without water, and yeah, you, you can survive a little bit without water. So I think water should be the second priority, right? I, I think so. Ted is right. Ted is right. We need some signals for passing planes and ships. Thank you. Maybe I'm not the only. Thank you. I'm not. Oh my god. Thank you. I'm, maybe I'm not the only seeing one here. Uh, I think maybe staying alive is a little more important. Well, you guys can look for drinkable water. What? Well, my ass, Garen hasn't done anything yet. I, uh... Oh, stop whining. Don't be that hard. It won't be that hard to look around the island. This is not a solo task. Oh my goodness. Take, take George with you. He's the only best one I can help. Just go, Garrett. You'll be fine. Alright, do your thing then, guys. Gary is just like, oh my goodness. He can't stop top making those references. Music is awesome. How is any, how is anyone ever gonna find us out here? I mean, we could actually try yelling really loud. I really don't think I really don't think that's gonna work, Rita. No, I was being uh, never mind. Stop going around. We need to find a way to connect with the world of pirates. What if we write something in the sand? Maybe get all dreams of and plans for dirt with things here for blah blah. Uh I'll start cleaning up there. Alright, so he's gonna start cleaning up the stuff and I'm gonna find some bits and pieces of wood that I can use. Ah! Oh, a landmine, wait a second. <laughs> he, he's convinced that, um, man, he is just, he is convinced that someone is spying on us, by rating us and everything we do. I'm sure we're doing great, Teddy. What do you think they're testing us on? Honestly, Teddy, I have no idea what you're talking about. Well, what did you do before the incident? I was in a brush of coffee. No, what did you, oh my goodness, Teddy. <sighs> he is just, uh, I think he, I think he went a little bit insane. Um, at the crap. I don't want to talk to Teddy. Thank you. Yeah, it's really weird. I, I don't know. I don't know what the problem is. Teddy is a little bit crazy from the 
crash, so, um, yeah. It's kind of weird. Oh, we did see something over there. Don't, uh, what did you do, Teddy? I used to work for the government in their intelligence building. Confidential information was right on my nose every day. You think they're after you? Of course, that's why they're after me. I didn't. I didn't want to get a job with them because I wanted to. I didn't get a. So apparently, because he didn't want to work for them, he got a job. Uh, why did you then? The sand has yours, Rita. Let's just say it was a good place to get the information I needed. All right. Well, let's finish. Yes. Oh my God. Teddy, he's like. Like, look at him. He, he's mentally insane. He is mentally insane. Alright, what is this thing over here? Hey there, little guy. What have you got there, Rita? It does. Maybe falling off the plane. All out in scares. Oh my goodness. So. Oh my goodness. They're gonna they're gonna name him. Uh, I don't see a name. Whatever, got nothing. Let's finish up the SOS. Good. What is this? I don't even know. Alright, let's uh, pick up this thing, get back over. To the what's it called? Here we go. Don't talk to Teddy. I want to get this job done. Okay, thank you. My goodness, Teddy. I don't know. It's really weird. One of the key things for this game is it seems like that most of the time, at least at the beginning, uh, if you do everything yourself, you, things will usually turn out in the best. But at the end, it doesn't really work that good. There we go, that should be suspicious. Looks good to me. Maybe a ship will be able to find us now. Speaking of which, what's that light out there? What? Oh, I see it too. It doesn't look like it's moving. It must be an oil platform or something. It's really far away. It's too far to tell anything from here. Yeah, let's go back to camp. I'm sure glad it was with you. I'm sure glad that it was you who came with me. I don't trust everyone that's here. What do you mean? Well, Garrett, for example. I've heard he's been on play for over two years. Yeah, well, I suppose he's probably never better. I sup- Oh my god. Ugh. No, uh, nobody spends that much time alone in a basement without doing something val- va val- 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 villainous, uh, I suppose. Uh, we should head back before it gets dark. How has it gotten dark already? I mean, I, I guess. I mean, SOS sign. I don't know. We have successfully created the SOS signal on the beach by calculating we should be saved by next hour or two. Did you spell it right? Um, okay. We didn't get a fight about it. Alright, what did you got to say then, Rita? We also noticed a light in the distance off the shore. It was too far to swim, but maybe we could build something to get out. Duh. are certainly good knowledge to have. Uh, that's pretty much... Actually, we also found this disc. Uh, it kind of looks like it has a face on it. Oh my gosh, so let's name it Disky. I told you that name was unoriginal, Teddy. Great, we're great, we're going crazy. This is why we this is why you don't have friends, Steve. Oh right, my bad. I forgot to make them up. <laughs> uh okay, that's enough. What did you find, Steve? Actually, I found I, th I think we found something, but we need some help getting to it. A lot of wreckage was too heavy to lift. There's more pe the more people the better, that's for sure. Sounds like we have a pretty useless day. Uh, yeah, did you find water, Garrett? Um, well, I spent most of my days lost. Are you serious? Oh my goodness, you thought I knew it was going a little separated. All the plants plants look the same. Well, because of Shut-Eye, we can look tomorrow. Yeah, I think we'd all consume your dress. I'll grab a torch. So, um, Garrett was off pretty much daydreaming in his video game world. So, yeah, um... But still, I don't know. These two seem like they're really close together. Like, I don't know. I do not know. How far can I get away? Oh, all right. All right. Let's talk to, uh, I want to talk to all three people here. Uh, so you and Jolene travel a lot. Oh, yeah. She loves to travel. Only her? Oh, well, I didn't mean that. I, I really don't mind it. I do miss the safety of getting home when we're gone. I, I do it for Jolene, no? You two must really love each other. Well, yes. Yes, we do. Why the hesitation? Oh, I don't know. Things have been different lately. How so? How they been different? Oh, I don't know. Just lots of little things. I'm sure that's nothing. I'm just being a little paranoid. Maybe getting stuck on this island will be good for us. We can have a simply we can have a simple life away from everything for a little while. Um, maybe it wasn't meant to be. You love each other, George. Not my place to comment. You love each other, George. You love each other too much, George. I'm sure you'll figure it out. Maybe you're right. Ooh, I need to get some rest. Have a good night, Rita, for sure. All right, let's talk to you. 
we, we still got a lot of work to do. Yeah, it seems like this work is never gonna end. George always says work for you is the best thing, so yeah. I think that is the only thing we disagree on. Yeah, maybe there's more than this one. From what I understand, no marriage is without little disagreement. But I guess I shouldn't act as the authority on that. You'll see one day. Marriage can be a complicated thing. Uh, yeah, maybe. You're a strong woman, Rita. You ought to, you ought to have everyone swooning over, swooning over you. Haha, <laughs> maybe. I'm gonna get some sleep. Good night, Rita. All right, let's talk to Garrett. It sucks so we weren't able to get water. Yeah, we're gonna have to figure that out soon. I just hope that we don't have to get kicked off this. Oh my goodness. I hope that I'm kicked out from my guild for this. I'm pretty sure you'll be fine. I just have a. I just have. I just. I have to get off this island. Um, we all want off, Garrett. Do you think the rest of us. Do you, don't you think the rest of us don't want to get out of here? No, you don't understand. I can't afford to be stuck on this island right now. What What do you mean? <sighs> Garrett, no one cares right now about your video game. I don't... I do not care. What can so... Earth without, without my help of all my friends will be homeless. Your friends will be home. Are you paying rent for them? You'd say that. They're going to lose their home if I didn't, don't finish my quest. Well, let's just make sure we get off this island. Thanks, Rita. Alright, time to go to bed. So, what's... Wait, so... Did I miss something, apparently? I feel like that, um... I don't know if Garrett's still in his video game mine at all. I'm not quite sure what he's doing. Alright, day three. Let's get to the end of this day and... Uh, let's, uh, probably finish up this thing. One more night down. I'm gonna need to stretch out my legs and move around. You're right. Sure would be nice to take a walk. I'm starting to, I'm starting to get pretty hungry. We're going, we're going to go days without food. Just stay strong. Can we focus here? We gotta figure out what we're doing today. Yesterday, Reed and I constructed an SOS beacon on the beach. Great, I don't know how that's supposed to help us when we still have no fresh water source. Sorry, I tried my best to find one. Plus, I wouldn't mind some extra help explore the plane wreckage. Alright, let's go get some water. Uh, water's important. I'll come with you, Garrett. We'll make sure to get some this time. We'll bring our empty airline bottles just to carry in. Whoa, okay. What about the wreckage? Sorry, okay. I'll help you out, Steve. Why don't you come with us, Teddy? Fine, it's more productive than sitting at this camp. I'll go with you, Garrett, Rita. You might need a hand. Thanks, George. Alright, everyone. Let's get a move on. Okay, here we go. So, we're going to get fresh water with these two. Oh, you know, it's too bad my trusting fishing pole got here. My, It's too bad that my trusty fishing pole here got broken on the plane crash. If we actually found a pond or something, we could have gone fishing in it. You know, the only thing of- yeah, oh my god, it's the only thing of mine that survived the crash was my game break. <sighs> no one cares. I guess this place, we got to find some water. There's no water here, let's get what we got. Gotta be truthful water, let's put it up in terms of vicinity. Alright, um, let's see what we've got here. It looks like we got some tracks here. Uh, animals we drink too, I bet that we need to follow and find these water. Yeah, let's follow them. Alright, we're off, come on Garrett. Alright, here we go, let's find some water. Yay, we found some water and started raining. Well, found water. Of course it had to start raining just before we got here. Wait, I think I just saw something move in there. I doubt if anything. Let's just get back to the camp. Alright, um, I'll go. I'll, I'll go. It'll just take a second. My series is up. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, quicksand. My feet are stuck here, guys. Oh, jeez, we got a snake. We got a snake. That's definitely a snake. Alright, uh, stand very still. That's the best thing to do in this situation. Yeah, if you're in quicksand, stand very still, because it won't, uh, it won't dry down and it won't cause attention to any things that are stalking you. I'm standing very still. Do you think, uh, did you think it would just, did you think this would just revive us? Come on, we have to deal with this on here. Okay, use a weapon. BAM! Nailed it. I got it! Good going, Rita. Come on, Garrett, let's help her get out of the mud. Why would they step into the mud if... I don't know. Uh, we should collect some water with something else before something else shows up. Uh, don't have to tell me twice, let's hurry. Alright, let's get some water from the water bottles of our, uh, plane thing. That's nice that we got water. Alright, so we got an SOS signal, we got water. 
Okay, everybody's still alive for the time being, and we have filled all our bottles. We should probably head back to camp before it gets too dark. Alright, yeah, let's go. Oh my. Ready to go? Yeah, let's head back. Alright, she's always we got pound. Yeah. Alright. My voice is getting so tired from talking so much. Oh my goodness. Oh jeez. Whoa! That was really loud. It's not awful close. I wonder if it struck anything. I hope the others are doing all right with without the wall. I don't even know what he said. Uh, they'll, they'll be fine. I didn't think to take care of themselves. They'll be fine. Jolene, maybe. I'm Jolene, maybe. The others I'm not so confident about. Can we get moving? It's cold. Yeah, keep moving. All right, I gotta get to camp. And... <sighs> Here we go. Whoa, guess what, everyone? We were able to get water. It was quite the task, but nothing stood in our way. You're telling me. Good thing we have reflexes like ninjas. Garrett. Yeah! It's raining. You could have just collected the water from the rain. Um, yeah, but... But at least we found a water source that'll last forever, Steve. Whatever. He has a point, Steve. It doesn't matter now. We have the water. Fair enough. Anyway, we should all take a drink now that we can. Alright. Yes. Finally. Yay. Alright, so we got water. Why is he smoking that cigar? Is that a cigar? Like, it always looks like a... Uh, one of those things that you put in your mouth, like that when you go to the doctor. Uh, much appreciated. Water is the only thing that we can't afford going without for a while. Now we're just gonna be fine, Garrett. So how did the search at the plane wreck go? We had the wildest ride. We were walking around in the plane to have a talk about what we would go looking for. Jolene did most of the talking. When it started to rain, seems like that rain is covering a large area. Anyway, suddenly a huge wall of lightning came out of the sky and struck the plane. No, we were lucky not to get struck, but if we didn't get any, but we didn't get anything useful from the plane. But in the end, does it even matter? Maybe we should continue this over by the tenth, where we can keep dry. Right, I'll grab a torch. Oh my goodness! All right. Jeez. Can I go back? Okay. This rain is quickly getting worse. It's really cold. Well, the shelter is keeping us pretty dry right now. It's a lot colder out in the rain. We can make it through the night. We can find something better after the storm tomorrow. Why? I want to do that when we leave. That's the dumbest thing I ever heard. Okay, so um, I've played to this part before, and what happens is that a palm tree falls down, and my theory is that te whoever is there in Teddy's spot gets his legs... Uh, gets his legs hit. So I was lucky enough to switch. Um, uh, I was lucky enough to switch Steve. No, not Steve. The the mustache guy with him. So the palm tree fell on him. So I think that's the way to go because I'm pretty sure that if the palm tree fell on Teddy, uh, his legs would do something really bad and it wouldn't be good. That's the dumbest thing I've ever heard. Where would we even want to go? I don't know. We can find better shelter. Maybe there's somewhere. Th that we, the water won't get in. We can get lost in the storm and never find our way back. We could also get hit hypothermia and die. I think it's better to wait till morning. We can look and find shit at George. That's what we do. Rita, you being pretty bad. Don't tell me on your side. Uh, I think we should stay here. Uh, it's too abandoned inside. Let's get out of here for the night. What now? Give it up, Teddy. We're staying. Uh, it's my side of ten. is all soggy. Someone to switch with me. Quit whining. None of us stuck. You stuck with you take. Why don't you just stop? Um, George with him. So George is gonna switch. Uh, with him, if it'll make everybody quiet, fine, go to sleep. Small victory, but I'll take it. So, yeah, they're gonna switch spots, and the palm tree is gonna fall. Well, good night, everyone. Middle of the night, there's gonna be like a tsunami. It's crazy. Oh my goodness. Oh no. Guys! Hey, guys! Everyone wake up! What are you guys doing on your piano? Oh my goodness! Floodwaters! <laughs> hey, I guess I should have known something like this would happen. It's like a huge storm. Okay, if we were all smart enough, we would be we would be grabbing our stuff and going back. Oh, let's get ourselves out of here. Oh no, palm tree! Bam! Oh no, George! George, are you okay? Oh, I think I'm alright, but I can't move. Sweetheart, can't see what's going on. We need to get a torch. So let's go get a torch. Oh my goodness. Here we go. Oh, what's that? <gasps> okay. 
Oh my goodness, what should I do? Uh, uh, uh. Alright, I'm coming. I have to save, I have to save these humans. Oh my goodness, I have to save these hu- I have to s humans come first before food, I mean... Oh my goodness, alright, we got light, we got light! Alright, get a light up here! Uh, oh dear, it's his branch! Oh my mark! One, heave! Oh my goodness, alright, we got him. Here you go, Georgie, you're free! Alright, let's go! Let's get out of here! Uh, I saw some rocks more inland, maybe we can find some shelter underneath them. Alright, so we couldn't save the- we couldn't save the food? So that's not that's not really good. Up ahead under those rocks. Oh my goodness. Lightning. Alright, so we're going into the cave. Hopefully there's no uh mountain lions. Whoa, this cave is awesome. What is this treasure barrier sign? I really doubt there's treasure. Alright, this should probably be good protection from the storm though. Bigger than my apartment back at home. I have I haven't seen a storm like this in some time. Well let's try to get some sleep. If we're lucky this cave won't flood. Okay. All right, everyone. We made it to day four. I think that's where I'm gonna stop. Um. Yes. Yeah, so we got. I think we did pretty good. We got. We got a uh, water. Um. And an SOS sign. So yeah. I think uh, if we can just get food, we just need to get food and then get a better place to camp. I think. I think that's the best place. We we need to get some food and we need to explore. A little bit more so i think that's what we need to do so um yeah guys i hope you enjoyed play i hope you enjoyed uh watching me play this um and i will be coming out with another part or another two parts uh so you guys can watch this so all right so thank you for watching please make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you haven't already uh, and I'll see you again in the next uh, part of Discourse. Thank you. Goodbye.